Hello everyone, welcome to Learn with Abdul Basit. You might have heard about ChatGPT many times. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the ChatGPT. What does this ChatGPT do? What, what is ChatGPT? ChatGPT, it is a kind of bot. Now, what is a bot? A bot is a computer program. A bot is a computer software made by a human to assist in their work like Amazon Alexa, uh, Apple Siri, OK Google and the other voice commands or voice assistant systems are there which are made in artificial intelligence. Chat GPT is also one of its kind. It is made in open AI, open artificial intelligence in San Francisco on November 30, 2022. What, what is Chat GPT? Chat GPT stands for Chat Generative Pre-trained Transformer. It helps the users to get the answers. Whatever you ask from a search engine, you would be getting different results on the website. But this chat GPT is programmed in such a way that what you are asking in voice, it will answer you in voice. It looks like you are speaking to a human. It will answer your questions. It will answer your uh, queries. It will answer each and everything. Now, what does it consist of? It consists of man page, Man page is a thing which is a kind of software or which is a kind of data, which is a kind of uh, program. Internet phenomena. What does internet phenomena mean? Internet phenomena means what are the viral things we are watching on internet like the memes, the viral videos, the viral shorts and the viral things which are running or which are downloaded or which are uh, shared in millions or billions of views. That is known as internet phenomena. So it consists of man pages, it consists of uh, internet phenomena, it consists of BBS, bulletin board system. It may also be known as computer bulletin board system. Now what does this computer bulletin board system will do? Computer bulletin board system, it will upload, it will download, it will write, it will read the data. So chat GPT consists of first man pages, second internet phenomena, third BBS or CBBS. And in the last, it consists of Python. It is designed on Python. Python, it is a kind of software. It is used to design different kinds of programs. So ChatGPT, it is a software which is made by OpenAI and it was invented. It was introduced on November 30th, 2022. And it is open for everyone. Everyone can go to the website openai.com and scroll down and you can go to ChatGPT there and you can click on that. Once you click on that, it will ask you to sign up. It will ask you to log in. If you are already signed up, it will ask you to log in. And if you are new, it will ask you to register or sign up. Once you sign up, then you may search for any category. You may search for music, you may search for notes, you may search for questions, you may search for uh, details, you may search for business, you may search for cooking, you may search for anything. It is a combination of artificial intelligence and human made uh, different things and it gives you the answers in such a way that you are talking to a robot. So it is an open platform. You can use it, you can download it, you can get all the details on that. Forward, going forward, I'll open my laptop, I'll share you how you can log in and how you can register and how you can get all the details on that. So until now I've told you what is ChatGPT, what it consists of. It consists of four main things. Man pages, the first thing. Internet phenomena, the second thing. Uh, BBS, bulletin board system or computer bulletin board system, the third thing. And the last one, it consists of Python. So ChatGPT, it is used everywhere. It could be used in category like security and services. It could be used in medical. It could be used in algorithms. It could be used in anywhere. If you ask any question, it will search in the background and it will give you the relevant answer. Now uh, it's in trial, so there could be some issues. There could be some bugs and the open AI, they have invented a feedback form. If you face any troubles, if you face any difficulties in not getting your answers, they are taking the surveys and they are upgrading their servers. So this is ChatGPT. What was before ChatGPT? Before ChatGPT, there was Instruction GPT. Instruction GPT were used in voice commanding systems like Apple, Siri or OK Google or any other like Alexa, play the song. So that was Instruction GPT. It was used before ChatGPT. So now ChatGPT, what are its uh, pros? Its pros are it can compose music, it can write an essay for you, 
it can uh, get the work done get the work done doesn't means that it can wash your dishes and it can clean your home it can do the vacuum for you no it will do the work related to the software like it plays the fairy tales it gives you the results the questions you have asked for it could be mathematical question it could be a biological question it could be a physical or chemistry or whatever it is whatever the subject you will ask it will give you the details in that so going forward i'll, I'll let you know how you can make use of chat gpt next what it can do it can emulate the linux software means it can do some changes in that and it can simulate an atm how does an atm work what will happen if you insert the card and then what will happen if you uh, type the pin incorrectly three times and how the cash will be dispensed from the dispenser box each and everything so what you want you can get all the details from the chat gpt this was a short video here i have opened the google chrome and in the address bar i'm typing openai.com so once i have opened the openai.com here at the bottom you can see chat gpt once we click on that you would be able to see this and it will show you try chat gpt once we click on that it will ask you for registration sign up or login uh, if you are already signed up so you can click on login so i have already signed up so i am clicking on login once i click on login it will prompt me for username and the password so here i am uh, typing my username and the password once i type in the username and the password it will ask me all the details to fill out like the mobile phone uh, the details once i type in the mobile phone and all those things it will pop up this window this is a free research pro provider how we collect data uh you can see all those things these things would be popped up once you type it so now you could be able to see the examples the capabilities and the limitations of this project now i'm searching something what is the uh what is today's temperature so here i did not uh, give the location so it will give me i'm sorry i don't have access to current weather information you can check a reliable weather source for the latest temperature so what is the world i'm typing something else when can we use a and the in english so it will come up with the results a and the are the articles and they can be used in different sentences or something else like that so uh, this is how the open ai have designed the chat bot or chat gpt this is how it will give the details like uh, you might see on the screen it will give all the uses of a and it will give all the uses of the each and everything so it's in trial if there are semi any bugs or something it will give you all the details there if you like this video and if you find any information useful in this video it's a request from my side please click on the link below and subscribe to my channel and please share it with others thanks for watching my video i'll come with a new video with some other topic keep watching my channel have a good day